I think digital technology is already revolutionising asset management. I think that in this area, sharing best practice and collaboration is key. Um, looking at who's best, well, none of us are, are the best at absolutely everything, although we try very hard to be, but learning from each other, collaborating, and really trying to raise that bar is the key to all of this. So from an electricity point of view, electricity system operator point of view, the networks of the future are going to be very flexible, that competition will be everywhere, so before an asset investment decision is made, we'd have looked at the market solutions, we'd have looked at the network providers, would have put that out to competition to see what is the right solution for consumers. If we expand the customer journey view to include our assets, telemetry, operational data, all of a sudden you've got this view of cause and effect right. And it might actually allow us to reveal the effect of our decision making, but better drive smarter decisions because we can start to quantify the other impact that not investing in certain things has. You know, so something might have failed. Well, now we can quantify not only the operational impact, but also the customer impact. Maybe 80% of the electricity network for 2050 is either built or being built now. But what will be really different is two things. One, the control technology layer that sits on top of that electrical network asset base. And two, the um, software that sits within the control tools that is utilising that control technology and then that electrical network. And that's where the real innovation and revolution is coming. 